I hope they wake up soon. I'm disappointed that they tried to run away, and I hate the idea of having to punish them, but I have to ask them why they tried to escape. It's getting kind of annoying waiting so long. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> there you are, darling. Did you have a nice nap? Hey, hey. <sighs> Calm down. I'm... I'm not mad at you. Well, <laughs> I... I'm a bit mad at you, but I promise that I'm not going to hurt you. I know you tried running away, and... I said you'd really regret it, but <laughs> I don't believe in corporal punishment. I, I don't want to hurt you, and honestly, if I tried, I probably wouldn't be able to. I just want to ask you, why did you try running away? You can tell me, silly. I'm... I'm not gonna hurt you. Please, just... tell me. You... you wanted to go home. <laughs> well, that's silly. You... you are home. Oh, you... you mean your old home. I think I get it. Uh, I know that change is a bit rough. You you suddenly woke up here one day, and I haven't let you leave. I was starting to trust you quite a bit, but now the trust has been lost because you ran away. Well, yeah, I, I told you on day one, don't even think of trying to escape. I would look for you, and I would find you. It doesn't matter where you run off to, I'd find you regardless, and clearly, I I found you. Shh, there, there's no need to cry, darling. I, I promise I'm not going to do anything too cruel to you. I, I'm certainly upset that you tried to run. I mean, I do a lot for you here. I I feed you, take care of you, I make sure you're clean and stuff. You don't really have to do anything, so I don't see why you'd want to leave. No, I, I'm not going to untie you for a while. You ran away, so, obviously, I can't trust that you won't try again soon. So, you're staying tied up for a while. <laughs> I know it sounds scary and upsetting, but this is your punishment. You, you need to know that you're not supposed to run away. It's a pointless effort, anyway, since, like I said, I'd find you regardless. I always knew how shy you were. So nervous. <laughs> so shy. It was quite endearing. I... I knew I had to have you. And I knew that you would be... A a bit frightened when you ended up here, but I figured I could gain your trust in due time. Shh, shh. Here, I'll, I'll hug you. I really shouldn't be giving you affection since you were naughty and tried to escape that I can't resist the urge. It's too powerful. <laughs> no, no, I... I can't let you go, silly. 
so don't ask. You're mine forever, and frankly, the sooner you accept that, the better it is for the two of us. <laughs> you might think I'm crazy, but I can assure you that I'm not crazy. I'm not scary. I'm not mean to you. There is absolutely no need for you to be afraid or want to leave. You'll be okay here. I I promised I'd take really good care of you. And I'm a person of my word. Don't you worry, darling. You're safe. What's your punishment? Oh, well, nothing physical. Well, besides being tied up. I'm not gonna loosen them unless your skin starts turning blue or purple. I... I know it might be a bit uncomfortable, but this is because you tried to run. I hope it doesn't hurt you. I'd hate the idea for it to hurt you, even if you were disobeying me. Shh. Shh. It's okay. Look at me. Even if you were naughty, I... I still love you. I'll still treat you well. But... I'll treat you much better once when you start to stay with me willingly. Then, you won't have to be tied up here, and you'll be able to roam our home. Now, I've got some food for you. You know what to do, darling. That's good. You're being smart and obeying me to eat. I, I definitely don't want to force feed you. You don't like the food? Well, at least you ate it willingly. Oh, that's another thing. I'm not gonna cook your favorite foods for a while, since you tried to run away. Yeah, I, I know it seems harsh, but you should have thought of that before trying to run away. It's a shame, since I really like to cook your favorite foods, and... Seeing that you at least enjoy something here, since you don't really want to be here, even though I do so much for you. Well, I suppose you're right. I did sort of kidnap you, but I did it out of love. I love you more than anything in the world. That's why I took you to begin with. I... I needed you in order to be... happy. I watched you for so long, and... after I finally gathered the courage to take you... I felt so much better. You're the most perfect person in existence. I'd do anything for you. Well, I... <laughs> I guess I can't do that. So, perhaps I can't do anything. Well, more like I can't do everything, since I can't let you go. <laughs> well, like I've said in the past, darling, I love you way too much to let you go. You're mine, and only mine. And that's never going to change. Listen, I, I know you're a bit scared. I like how you're the shy, nervous type. It's so sweet that it melts my heart. You blush when I say you're beautiful, when I kiss you on the cheek or forehead, and sometimes even when I give you a hug. 
Here, let me try. <laughs> That's it, darling. <laughs> Aw, I knew you'd blush. You're so cute. <laughs> Shh, sh <laughs> I know, I know, honey. It's all gonna end up okay. You won't want to run away again. You know I love you. I, I gotta go for a bit, so I'll see you later. Goodbye, darling. I love you. <laughs>